Hi, I'm Matt with Ballast Tools Equipment. Today we're going to be reviewing the safety topics for our Caterpillar 450 high rail backhoe system. The battery is located in the compartment under the cab. You also have the battery disconnect, which can be used for standard lockout tagout procedures. Make sure that all electricity is disengaged prior to performing any maintenance. These are the safety locks on the high rail gear. Make sure that the locks are engaged in the up position as well as the down position to ensure that the high rail gear does not drift in road travel as well as rail travel. Be sure to maintain three points of contact when entering and exiting the machine. Be sure to stay clear of attachments and the boom swing while the machine is in operation. Always set the parking brake when exiting the backhoe. This is the Rototilt speed selector. Decrease the speed of the Rototilt until you are comfortable with the attachments. Once you've become proficient with the operation of the attachments, you may increase the speed to your desired level. Make sure that all personnel is clear when uncoupling attachments from the backhoe. Be sure to use the safety locks on the loader arms when performing any maintenance on the loader bucket or the loader arms. Stay clear of the outriggers when raising and lowering them into work positions. Avoid any and all pinch points when flipping the outrigger pads over. Remove the strobe light before transporting the backhoe. The strobe light is rated for 50 miles an hour and needs to be removed before highway travel. There are two mirrors located on the boom to give adequate visibility to the rear high rail wheels. Be sure to engage the boom lock prior to traveling with the backhoe. Be sure to install the swing lock pin prior to road traveling the backhoe. This is the extend hoe lock pin. Be sure to remove the pin prior to use of the extend hoe With the backhoe in the travel position, the machine is 13 feet 8 inches from the ground to the top of the stick. Be sure to verify when traveling underneath bridges that there is sufficient clearance for the backhoe. If need be, unlock the boom and lower the boom to go underneath lower clearance bridges. This is a proper storage position for the undercutter when road traveling the backhoe. This is a proper storage position for the tamper attachment when road traveling the backhoe. This is a proper storage position for the tie head when road traveling the backhoe. The first aid kit is located here. The fire extinguisher is located here inside the operator's cab. Thanks for watching. And for more information, check out our website. And as always, be safe out there.